what is up everybody so before we start today's video i just want to thank everybody who has subscribed to the channel and who has been supporting all the content um we are now at 700 subscribers which is crazy i never thought we'd actually reach this many so our new goal is 1000 and on the rate that we're going i feel like we can make it so thanks everybody for subscribing to the channel euro What's up everybody? What is up everybody? It's currently Wednesday afternoon. Just laid down the girls for a nap. So that means we are about to go out to the garage and do something little today. My buddy borrowed me some toe plates two weeks ago and I was supposed to return them to him like two weeks ago. So I'm gonna try to get this knocked out today. This would be my first time using toe adjusting plates. It's pretty straightforward. You put the plates against the two front wheels, take two measuring tapes, and you compare measurements. Pretty straightforward. I'm gonna try to document it for you guys, just to show you guys how to align your vehicle. So I say we get to it. So over the weekend, I redid the garage, repainted it, fixed this piece of board that was right there. It was all routed out, and then I redid the trim Replace that piece of wood, replace that piece of wood. And uh, definitely looks better. Also, we finished this up. Finished up a bunch of landscaping. Goes all the way around the house. I say the wife has been busting her butt. But overall, it looks really good, I must say. Got the girls' little play area. Don't mind the garage. All this is from my dad's storage unit. So we'll be putting that up in the attic. And yeah, this garage is literally a disaster right now. All right, so here's the toe plates. Like I said, it's pretty straightforward. You got two plates, two measuring tapes. And all we're gonna do is press them up against that front wheels and then put two, two measuring tapes, front and back, and then we're gonna get our measurements. We're gonna start off against this. So we're sort of towed out. We're towed out. We gotta come in. So that means this gotta come out. We're spinning tie rods that way. This needs to come out. So we're spinning it this way, we're spinning tie rods that way. Counterclockwise. Alright, so based on our numbers. We are towed out from the front. So that being said, the back of the wheel needs to come out. So since the tie rod spins counterclockwise to come out, we are going to lock this onto the tie rod end and spin it clockwise. And that's going to bring this side out. So we're going to go by turn by turn and then measure again and go from there. This is not easy on the ground. It'd be a lot easier if I had a hoist or an underground pit. That'd be great. So I've given it two turns. All right, 
let's re-measure. So we look. We're a quarter notch for that nine. Oh shoot, I think I got it dead on. So if you look real closely, when I pull this side tight, I'm basing it off of that nine. And we are one, two, three, four notches before that nine. This side, pull it tight. We are one, two, three, four. Pretty dead on. I will say we're uh, pretty much there. That wasn't bad at all. It's not 100%, but it'll get me by. Yeah, see. So we're pretty even. Um, the only problem is, I don't know if it's playing tricks with my eyes, but I don't know if we look at this one. It looks fairly straight. this one and it looks towed out like I said I think it's just my eyeballs playing tricks on me numbers don't lie but yeah I think we got it decent enough to take a two-hour trip I think I hope all right so after giving this thing the alignment we're about to take it for a test drive. I'm gonna throw you guys on the head mount and uh, throw you guys on the head mount and see how this thing drives. I'm hoping we drive straight. Last time I drove, the steering wheel was cocked to the side like this, but it drove all right. I was doing 90 on the highway and it seemed all right. But now that we corrected it, let's just hope we're all good to go. to really tell but I think the steering wheel stays pretty straight and it's driving straight so oh damn I just hope I didn't blow my wheel on that
All right, that's gonna wrap it up. It was gonna be a short little video today. I figured I'd show you guys on how to align your vehicle with these tow plates. My buddy said he bought them off of Amazon for like 60 bucks. I'm not 100% sure on that. Uh, if I can find them on Amazon, I will put it in my description. But it, this thing also comes with a camber gauge, negative, positive. My wheels are all aluminum, so it doesn't even work. But yeah, comes with two plates, two measuring tapes, and a camber gauge. The only thing you're gonna need are wrenches to undo your tie rods and to make your adjustments. But like I said, it's not 100%. I would have to put this thing on an alignment rack. But overall, I mean, wheels look pretty dead center. The wheel is straight. The steering wheel, or the steering wheel is straight. My wheels are straight. So we should be able to go on a pretty long cruise. Like I said, I got, I got my wheel dead straight. I hope this thing, or this video helps you guys out. Um, like I said, it's very, very simple. Anybody can do this. You just need the space to do it, really. You don't even have to jack your car up or anything. So, <sighs> um, this weekend we do have a um, Cars by the Creek. I don't know if you guys seen my last video from last year when I first, first bought this car. We took it on a voyage. It was like an hour and a half drive. So that was the whole reason why I'm doing this alignment. After this, I'm actually gonna be nut and bolt checking the whole entire car. The last drive that I took it on, I heard a noise coming from the rear back here. So I'm hoping it's just something little like a shock bolt or something. I don't know, 100%, but I'm gonna do my best to film the car show for you guys, put out some more content. And also I really need to give this car a bath. As you see, we got dirt, bird poop. We got freaking pine cone stuff all over it. It's literally, it's gross. It's freaking gross. That's gonna wrap up today's video though. Like I said, I hope you guys enjoy it. I hope it helps everybody out there who needs to align their vehicle. I think you can do this with two by fours as well, but these toe plates are the most accurate you can get unless you go to an alignment shop. So. I'll catch you guys this weekend when we are at Cars by the Creek.